Today on MTG Unpack, we're getting stuck into a gift edition bundle of The Brothers War. So this was released today, December 2nd, 2022. So you get a whole bunch of awesome stuff here. The main difference between this and the regular box is you get a different spin down and a collector booster. So let's get to cracking here. Looking forward to it. We'll also be getting stuck into some Jumpstart 2022 along with the Starter Commander decks this weekend. So stay tuned. And I don't remember this. Okay, so we've got a different poster thing here. Alright, and a nice shiny box. Looks very schnaz. And these are different as well. So we've got some Transformers on the other side, Optimus Prime. Alright, here's our uh, Collector Booster, we'll set that aside. And then we've got the, what is it, 8 packs, yep, set boosters. And let's take a look at the awesome Spin Down. Okay, so the set symbol here, oh that's different, okay, they've got a uh, Transformers symbol on there. Let's roll a lucky 7. 18, never mind. Alright, so I guess I'll look at the promos and stuff as well. So we've got these cards here. Things about uh, playing the game, if you're new to Magic. So this is just a basic land pack. I think these are just regular lands, so we'll have a quick flick through. Yep, a couple of each, regular, basic land. And then the promo here, I'm curious if it's any different. So we'll check it out. Okay, I think this is the same. So we've got Queen Kyla Bin Krug with the foil retro border. And Ultra Magnus Tactician Mythic. And on the other side, we have Ultra Magnus Armored Carrier. I think that one's the same as well. And then all of the lands here you got in foil, okay? So we'll skip over that. So let's get to cracking. So set booster time. See if we can get something awesome. So this, I believe, is a mountain artwork. It is indeed. We've got a full art planes, Argothian Opportunist Wing Commando, Clay Revenant. Mask of the Jade Crafter for the Uncommons, Gurgling Anointer, Yushin Tactician, Urza Power Stone Prodigy, that's not the meld version. We've got Millstone for the Artifacts, Quieter Spike with the Schematic Art, and the rare is Mishra, Tamer of Mac Fowler. And again, no melding on that one. Foil Horned Stone Seeker, and a Power Stone Token. Yeah, so I've got a vast collection of Power Stone tokens at this point. Pretty much enough to wallpaper the house. Uh, here we have... I think that's Battlefield Forge, is that correct? Mystic Forge, okay, one or the other. Got a Foil Forest, along with Wasteful Harvest Scatter Ray. Deadly Repost, Curate, Scrapwork Cohort, Audacity for the Uncommons Recruitment Officer, Gnawing Vermin, Icor, Wellspring, and Teething Wormlet. That's fun. Foil Trench Stalker, and a Troll Card. I call those Troll Cards because you would hope to get a list pull in that slot. So these gift bundles go for about 50 bucks US, so about $15 more than the regular. Which is a decent deal because you get a uh, collector booster. We've got Mishra claimed by Gix for the art card. A forest, Yoshin Medic, Overwhelming Remorse, Lauren's Escape, Ashnod's Harvester for the Uncommons, Forging the Anchor, Lay Down Arms, Gaia's Corsa, and Semblance Anvil. Okay, nice artifact. And a mythic mind's eye with the schematic art. Awesome. Kyla's Command, rare foil recommission, 
And another Power Stone. Let's grab a sleeve here for the first Mythic of the video. Actually, we did get the Transformers card, but I'm not counting that. On to the next one. Will it be a Troll card or List Pool? So this one is Maze Mind Tome. You can probably figure that out from the artwork. We've got an island. Prison Sentence, Might Stones Animation, Excavation Explosion, Hero of the Dunes for the Uncommons, Mask of the Jade Crafter, Static Net, and Disciple of Kalis Nin. Okay, so a Commander Rare. Rescue Retriever, another one. Sigil of Valor, let's fix my piles here. And a Mythic, yes, Titania, Voice of Gaia. And this one flips around. Half of the card, Titania Gaia Incarnate. So that's the meld mechanic. We'll sleeve that one in a second. Foil Goblin Firebomb. And Quicksilver Dragon from the list. And I think we've pulled that one before, but awesome artwork. Okay, so two Mythics doing nicely. Actually, if you get one Mythic out of one of these, you're doing okay. But two is above average. We've got some more schematic art, um, something lantern, I'm going to say. What is it? Soul Guide Lantern, that's the one. And an island, Mishra's Onslaught, Power Plant Worker, Blitz Automaton, Military Discipline, Gruesome Realization for the Uncommons, Keeper of the Cadence Steel Exemplar, and Icor Will Spring for the Artifact, Ivory Tower, another one. And Transmogrant's Crown for the rare foil Citinal Stewart. And what is this? Magic minigame. Urza's Blueprints. Yes! The best pull of the video yet. And everyone agrees with that statement. So there you go. And we get a signed art card here. Ashnod's Altar. That is creepy as we've got the schematic art, a foil planes, along with prison sentence, wing commando, goblin firebomb, shoot down, horn stone seeker for the uncommon Zephyr Sentinel, Mishra excavation prodigy again, and a mythic ultra magnus tactician. All right, and on the other side, we saw him, he's the uh, promo card, ultra magnus armored carrier. Won't bother sleeving him. Elsewhere, Flask and another Mythic. Root Wire Amalgam. That's about a buck or so. So four Mythic pulls. Foil Fateful Handoff. And Mishra's Helix. I like the retro border on this one from Urza's Block. Okay. Two more packs, then we'll get into the Collector Booster. So I believe with the number of mythics here, we're probably in the greatest hits playlist at this point. Link in the corner, the greatest hits in channel history. So the art card here is Fauna Shaman. We've got a Forest, Overwhelming Remorse, Stern Lesson, Epic Confrontation, Power Stone Engineer, Fog of War, Hero of the Dunes, The Uncommons, Mask of the Jade Crafter, Static Net, Self-Assembler for the Artifact. And Mishra, Tamer of Mac Fowler. Okay, so again, Foil, Wasteful, Harvest, and a Power Stone. One more set booster here. So this is actually an above average box. You're not normally going to get so many Mythics. So I'm well pleased with this. So here we have like a middle-aged Urza. Which one is it? It is Prince of Krug, along with an island, Koilos Rock, Gaia's Gift, Trench Stalker, Tornos' Tinkering, Aeronaut's Wings, Repair and Recharge for the Uncommons, Gaia's Corsa, Ashnod's Harvester, and Quicksilver Amulet. Nice! Like the artwork on that one. And Hercule Master Wizard for the rare Foil Transmogrant Altar. And another Power Stone. Let's get into the Collector Booster. So if I recall, yes, should have had a pair of scissors here because these things are tough to open. That's perfectly normal. They want people to uh, not 
rip into these if they're at your local Walmart or something. Okay, so lots of foils in these. We have Excavation, Explosion, Military Discipline, Stern, Lesson, Scrapwork, Mutt, Thran, Vigil, Giant, Cindermore, and a very cool Planes, Giant Robot Things, and Sky Strike Officer. We've got a rare Soul Partition Borderless Terra Ballista. That is awesome. Ivory Tower Foil with the Retro Pristine Talisman. That is not a foil. And Lodestone Golem. Along with Megatron Tyrant. Another mythic. Okay, on the other side we have Megatron Destructive Force. And oh, Mind's Eye again. Foil Mythic. This is insanity. One, two, three, four, five, six mythics pulled. And a Power Stone. I think we've probably beaten the record at this point. Ravnica Allegiance. Link in the corner. I think that one only had five Mythics in the box. So a pretty awesome haul today. Let me know in the comments if you picked up one of these. How did you do? Hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day.